Hey guys welcome back to another reddit video. If you do enjoy this story don't forget to like and subscribe. Now to the story. Ada for not inviting my dad and stepmom to my wedding? I, 28F, am engaged to my fiancé Dave, 28M. This week, I was going to my hometown and invited him to come with me so he can meet my family. He's met my brothers and my mom but not my dad and extended family. When I was 16, my dad cheated on my mom with a very well-known escort, then married her. Not only was I going through a tough time dealing with our family being torn apart, but I also had to deal with all the ridicule of having an escort stepmom. People weren't as open with sex work back then and it was hell for me when people found out. Especially since my stepmom was very vocal and confident about her work. I changed schools in my senior year because I couldn't handle everyone making fun of me because of my dad and stepmom. My older brother got suspended once because another kid made a joke about hiring our stepmom for a good time and they got into a big fight. I stayed with my mom full time and barely spoke to my dad or stepmom. My dad wanted equal custody of me and brothers, they were 17-14 years old at the time, but none of us wanted to live with him and his wife and he couldn't really force us to split our time for him. He also gave up making an effort to see us at all when we said we don't want to live with him half the time, so we barely saw him. When I finished high school, I left our hometown and moved to a big city for college. My brothers also moved there and our mom would come visit us all the time so I didn't bother go back to our hometown. Dad didn't offer to come see us and none of us have been back home so this week was the first time I've seen my dad in about 10 years. My auntie was hosting a dinner party so everyone can meet my fiancé and of course my dad and stepmom were there. I was polite to them but it was awkward and my fiancé was doing all the talking. Stepmom asked us when and where the wedding is and my fiancé told her. It's on the 2nd of December. She said, wow and you still haven't sent out invites? My fiancé just kind of looked at me awkwardly and I answered, we have sent out invites. But our guest list is limited and we're only inviting our closest friends and family, so I couldn't make space for you and dad, I'm sorry. She just smiled and said she understood. We aren't inviting anyone we aren't super close to. We'll be having 30 guests in total. The next day my dad comes to visit my fiancé and I at our Airbnb and he asks me why him and his wife aren't invited to our wedding. He said I'm his only daughter and he'll feel like a failure if he can't even walk me down the aisle. I said, it makes me sad that my dad won't walk me down the aisle either but I'm not going to make a fuss about that tradition when we have barely spoken since I was 16. We don't have a father-daughter relationship and I'm not going to pretend like we do just for my wedding. He started crying and asked how long I planned to punish him for what happened between him and my mom. He said he feels like he lost his children 12 years ago when he divorced my mom and now I'm putting the final nail in the coffin. I told him I don't hold resentment over his divorce with my mom and everything he did but the fact of the matter is that we aren't close anymore and I'm not interested in faking it. Ada, 